Hello everybody, my name is Farman, and welcome back to episode 5 of our Let's Play on the West Coast. So we're back. Um, both fields have been seeded. I haven't seeded field 10 because we need a cultivator. Um, I just went and tried it off screen and it doesn't get rid of the it doesn't get rid of the actual um, like dust that it leaves behind. So we're going to have to cultivate that. So we're going to need to buy one of them. But I managed to get these two done. I accidentally quit the game through FS through field 14 so that's got no cosplay so I've only got one field cosplay at the moment um, but we've got 63k so we're going to be going out and buying a mower because we're going to go do some mowing with the 7810 now somebody did point out in the comments that I opened the window wrong on the 7810 like you can open the just this bottom half but I don't know I kind of prefer tractors to have a fully open window than just two halves but yes you are correct you open this bottom one and I think this one stays in place I'm not sure but yeah I, I managed to see the I, I couldn't see the other uh, marker last time like there is one just here so anyway we're gonna go pick up the mower well we're gonna go buy it anyway after this thing does its 10 year start there we go. come on so we're gonna mow. We are. We're gonna have two mowers up there. We're gonna have a side mower and the PZ to run on the grey and gold because field 30 already has a cosplay course in it with the grey and gold and a PZ. So, but we're gonna be buying a side mower to go on this one, or trailed behind, shall I say? And then we're gonna whiz over and either we're gonna buy a field when we get up there if we've got the money. Lovely, lovely realistic driving there. Um. So yeah, um, wanted to just just discuss the multiplayer. We've got something in the works, and I mean, like tomorrow we are going to record the first episode of it. Not going to put any spoilers out there. Just going to say that this video will be out on the fourteenth of September, which is tomorrow. So the the video will be out for the fifteenth of September, which is the Friday. So there is a video coming. And you probably already guessed it already, but you know, it's something to look forward to anyway. And it is well, there's quite there's a few of us on there from who did, used to be in the other multiplayer, so we've uh, you know, and there's a couple of new people as well. Right, so let's buy the mower because we didn't actually do that when we looked at it. Now I'm going to go for a Chrome 402. Hopefully, it is the Chrome one. I'm not really bothered which one it actually is. And it's auto swath. Nope. <laughs> I don't like auto swaths. I never have done. That's unfortunate. That's took some of our money away, so we'll just buy that one. That one shouldn't be auto swath, I hope. Yeah, it's fine. So we're having a Kevland or Kaverland. I I am not sure. People tell me how to pronounce this name like a hundred times. I'd still get it wrong. It's a mower. It's a side mower. It's a trailed side mower, sorry. Trail behind. Now, give me the mower. Now, this is the issue with them. They are an absolute pain in the ass because this little head thing moves. Like the attacher joint moves all the time. Pretty sure I don't have manual attach in, but I'm going to have to keep jumping out. There you go, you little bastard. PTO's in, so we need to lift it out the ground. Oh, it's that one here. We're just going to keep bringing that up. And then we need to fold the sides in on it as well. Right, that's all good. So we'll go get this thing right. Actually, just wait here, 7, 8, 10. Right, so we'll have... I had quite a few field suggestions of what fields to buy. I think the best one for us, if we can afford it, is just one around here. So field 30 we're going to mow. And I want to mow another one to get as many bales out of it as we can. So what's this? That's 36. I'll buy that. Because we've still got all that stuff in storage. So we're okay for now. Um, I've, I even got the cedar filled right up. Now you may be thinking, oh, there's no money for a cultivator. Um, I will get the, the T7 running the trailer in a bit to oh you let me out cheers buddy to uh, actually 
Oh, he's pipping at me. Oh, disgraceful. To actually run the trailer to sell the grain that we've got all stored up. I might just sell all of it out of everyone and just build the money up. It just it just helps having that. You know, if we just build it all up quickly and have it all out, then we can kind of start what we need to start. Yeah, mom. Right. It's quite a long drive to the cow yard. I didn't realise this. And yeah, it is quite. A long. I was going to say something else, but I forgot. The way my mind works. Um, so I've also seen a comment with about nine likes, which is to have a TM one ninety and get rid of the T seven. We are going to do that. I have a one. T I have a TM one ninety somewhere in my mods folder. I will dig it out and put it in because it's not actually activated at this moment. So I can't. I'm not going to get rid of the T seven till I've got it activated and I can afford it. Um, and then we should slowly start to expand the arable land. And somebody said buy field twelve. That is uh, a good option. We are going to do that. But we'll have to do that once we can expand the farm. If We'll see what all this crop gets us out of the out of the storage point um, to, to start with. And we'll see what that gets to. Because that could get us a tasty little profit in. Which then may be able to afford to pay for field 12. Which isn't that much. It's only about 60 grand I think. 60, 70 grand. Which you thought on this map they would have been a lot more expensive, but maybe that's just the way it is. Like maybe that's just the way he's well, it is the way he set it, but maybe that's the way you know that the game did it because he's done the field markers, I think, to have missions in. What did he? No, I don't. I'm not sure. It's a fair old run this. Right, I think we'll leave we'll do field thirty and I'll do field twenty one off screen. And then when we get the this is when the two mowers will become handy because I can have the grey and gold course played in field thirty mowing it happily. I think the cosplay course is still there. Yeah, field thirty mowing. It's a bit too big for this uh, this mower here. But we might as well get it mowed with this whilst we're here. Uh, we may have to move the bell trailer. Might just leave the bell trailer, actually, to be honest with you. Everything's going to bring up course plate. Because for some reason, everything is set that way. Now, that bell trailer might be in the way for the last cut. I'm not sure, but. Right, that'll do as a... I'm sorry about this, but we need to just grab the uh, screenshot. Thumbnail. Pose. There we go. I should probably not, you know, keep saying that, but... Right, let's do this in cab, because it just... It's a bit nicer. The cab's not too bad on her. And I can see it behind me. So we're doing 9 mile an hour. Um, so I'll probably mow this field and mow the other one whilst I sort all this stuff out. But I'm still enjoying this. You know, there's nearly 20 hours on this save game already. So I'm getting through them. Um, but yeah, we... Uh, well, I'm, I'm hoping that, that I'm not going to get bored of it. But I, I, yeah, I've just been having issues, you know... Uh, you know, I haven't had really... This week, I haven't had too much time to play uh, in the way of... Last night, we were on multiplayer. Just a game someone had set up, and we were all on it, just messing about. Um, tonight, I've been on a digger at home. Uh, we did some... We've had a load of soil and stuff out there. We've, like, leveled the floor of the shed, which I do need to do a vlog on, but we've leveled the floor of the shed. And so we're moving all the soil again because we put it in a pile, but it was only temporary, so we've had to move it all again. So I've been doing that for a couple of hours. My back is still not 100%. It probably never will be, but it's 
It's okay. So, I haven't been able to rush around doing that. I've, uh, you know. But anyway, so, I'm just sitting down and playing. And for some reason, the time is really messing me up. I'm getting to about 8 o'clock and I'm knackered. And it, it, I'm recording this at 14 minutes past 9. Sometimes I record videos at like 14 minutes past fucking 12 at night. And I wouldn't be tired. But the last couple of days, I've been really tired. So that's why I'm... You know, that's why all the fields aren't done and it's not it's not how I wanted to start the video, but it's it's like either wait another day, which then pisses you lot off. Well it probably wouldn't do wouldn't do, but it, it pisses me off knowing that I haven't got a video out for you lot you guys, sorry. So you know. Or you know, record to push through the tiredness and record. I've still gotta do some other things, so push through the tiredness and record a mowing video, and a mowing video is good. I did say in the in the previous video that this video would probably be mowing, which it is. Um, but we're going to do both of these as hay bales. That's why I'm going to mow both because you never get too many out of one. And then somebody said, "Can you get the Fleming bale lifters?" Which you may do um, if I've got them installed. I'll buy them, but I still need to save money for a cultivator. But uh, I'll most definitely get all that grain sold, and we'll probably start buying the stuff once the grain is all sold because you know doing a cultivation course cultivate course is not difficult and I think I'll just do it the same as I did when I seeded field to field 15 where I jump cut all the boring shit um, we only watch a bit of it when I'm talking and then I just jump cut the rest which I kind of like doing because it makes me feel like you're not watching endless video and uh, you know endless amounts of crap that is not relevant to anything at all I'm not really going to jump, I'm not really going to edit this one too much because mowing, everyone loves mowing. We've got 7, 8, 10 and a, a tail, trail behind mower which everyone loves. Now the trail behind, there is a pack of these released and it, was, it wasn't meant to be released but it was. Um, I can't tell you where they are because I personally don't know but I know they're released because uh, I was talking to the bloke that had them leaked and released so. Um. You know, if you want them, you've got to try and hunt them down yourself. Um, now, a lot of people said, is this 7810 private? It is. This one is, because it's got the IC. There is one out there that doesn't have IC. So, you've probably seen the one that's released and been like, oh, it, you know, it's released, it, it, it's fine. But this one has IC, so this one, this is why this one's different. Um, it would it'd be nicer with a bit more of a texture cap. Why am I not sat in the seat? Oh, it's because I've got tra my track hat thing on. Almost called a track IR again. So, sunroof is nice and open. This map is so beautiful. I love it. I love it. But that's the problem. I, well, I've got so many maps I actually want to play. I've got three maps I want to play and not enough time to actually play them. Like, this map kind of goes to the back and it shouldn't. This map should be at the front. But I do like just, you know, coming on here, jumping on, doing a bit. And I, I always make sure if there is something to do, like seeding or I've got to sell crop, I will get it done most of the time. I mean, I didn't know about the OSR. Because that, that thing said you don't need to actually prepare your field properly for the next harvest. You can just cultivate it. Well, it does cultivate and seed. I thought it was going to do it, but it didn't get rid of it. So I'm going to cultivate it first and then seed it. But yes, field 14 needs a course putting on it because it hasn't got one. So how many rows have we done already? It's not a very big field to be honest with you. It is pretty small. Oh, this thing is so nice. Which is why I like doing this field on camera. And this is why the little tractor is going to get this field, not this one. Because whilst we mow this one, well, whilst the tra the course mow tractor mows this one, we can mow field 21. Um, I am going to... Ev like branch out up here and get a few more fields so we're probably going to get uh, the next one be field 22 and we'll go around in a circle until we've got almost all of them which would be a good probably million to get so we're not going to do that just yet um, but we're going to kind of slowly expand the two farms 
so like if we buy a field we bought a field for this farm so I think the next thing to do is save up for one for the arable and then after that save up for another one for the cows and the arable but once this field is done and these both fields are baled and stacked and everything we can get some cows in and that is what we want that is what we need because once the cows are in we can kind of just put straw grass and water in for now and then we'll get a feeder and all that stuff And then I think once we get to that stage, we'll put this 7810 up here. And then on the arable yard, we'll have the TM 190 and something else. And we'll get rid of the 3000 series Massey and the T7. Um, this thing won't be just like dumped up here and, you know, wrecked. We will, we will take care of it. We will, you know, run it just on the mowers and stuff like that. And we may bring a pressure washer up here. Because I really like these tractors. I like them in real life and I like them in game. I like the 7.6 and the 7.8. Because as you probably know, there's two people in my Discord who I play with. Joe and Tom. Who both, Joe has the 7.8 and Tom has the 7.6. Which is his dad's from original, well, it's from new. His dad bought it. Well, no. The, the, let me get this right. He's told me this story a hundred fucking times. His dad bought it. His dad's... the. The farm that his dad worked for bought it, then he bought it off the farm. I think that's correct. Tom will probably ball at me because it's probably wrong. But it, it, it is in original condition to, as well. Yeah, it is in original condition. It has a loader on as well. So does the 7-8. So, they have kind of very nice tractors. And you always see these ones at shows, the 7-8s and the 7-6s at shows. And they're always... Really nice. You see them at player matches. I like the Jubilee ones as well. They're nice. Now, someone will probably tell me in the comments, did the 7.6 ever have a Jubilee version of it? Because I know the 7.8 did, but I'm not sure if the 7.6 ever did. I'm not a big nerd on the Fords like Tom is, or, you know, I'm not, <laughs> I don't know why I called you nerds, but, you know, experts, or, you know, know a lot about them. There'll probably be someone shouting in the comments as they normally do, typing some harsh message about how my dumbass and and all this stuff. But oh well, such is life. Now the great thing about this mower is we haven't got to put we haven't got to put a windrow through this field. We can just hay bob these and that'll do, and then bail it straight up. We don't have to actually put a windrow through. Whoa. Simply because the rows are so nice, because this mower works so well. But, uh, yeah, it's a nice... I like the way this map is set as well. Um, it's set so you can mix between kit like this. We're running a 7, 8, 10 and a, side, and a trail behind mower. And, you know, this map is huge. This map is about 90 fields, and yet we're just running this kit. The other day when we were messing around in the multiplayer, we actually harvested field 16. Is it 16? Uh, yeah, harvest field 16 with potato. We had two potato harvesters running in there and we harvested it. Not the big ones, the trail behind ones. I was on one and someone was on the other, common brew. Um, and we harvested that field and it was fun. And we, we're actually going to harvest that in this, in this uh, single player. No, we'll get we'll wait a bit later. We'll get it a bit later on probably, but because I want to put them in the spud boxes as well. Um, so it's going to be a bit of a handful on my own, but this is why cosplay is so nice. I I hear people talk about cosplay being so crap and everything, and you know how they don't like it, how it's. You know, it never works for them and stuff. But once you get it, it's a bit of a headache to get working. It, I will admit that I got pissed off with it so many times. And I deleted it so many times. But I kept trying with it and trying with it. And now I can get cosplay to do almost everything. If I really wanted to, I could have a cosplay, almost cosplay run farm. There'd only be like two or three things that it couldn't do. Like, the only thing I don't think it'd be able to do is load. Stack bales. Uh, that'd be about it, really, and feed up, probably. You could probably get it to do that. Yeah, there's a lot of things... I'm just going to jump out of cab a sec. There's a lot of things you can get cosplay to do. 
just jumped our cab whilst we went near that post. Ah, we'll do some out of cab mode because we've been in it for the entire episode. But yeah, so you can get Cosmo to do a lot of things, and it's good because, all right, it has its it has its moments where it somehow drives into a hedge and stuff, and it's it always does it, and you never quite know why. But that's the way cosplay is. I was doing so well, and look, I missed a bit. Oh well, catch it like this. Right, let's just sort of run this to here. I'm going to run it round the post like this. Probably not the right way, but it's happening. I don't know why I did that. It's pointless. There's no grass there. I really want to change the grass textures on this map to my one, but I know it'd mess it up, and that means. If you ever wanted to do multiplayer, I'd have to, uh, I'd have to have just, well, I could have just a normal version of this stored on my desktop. And is it finished? Yes, it is. So, right, that's that finished. So, we'll open the gate and uh, we'll crack on with this one once... Uh, well, I'll crack on with this one on my own. So, uh, thank you everybody so much for watching. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more today. I'll see you all of you in the next video. Happy farming and goodbye.